All right, now, President Biden has been talking about this revamp of the Supreme Court. He wants to introduce at the LBJ Library today, a little, uh, a few minutes from now. He's saying we are going to figure out a way to get this done. Um, uh, among his remarks is apparently saying what is happening now is not normal, and it undermines the public's confidence in the court's decisions, including those impacting personal freedoms. We now stand at a breach. Uh, Louisiana Republican Senator John Kennedy on what he makes of all of this. Senator, good to have you. What do you think? Thank you. Well, a couple of thoughts. Number one, um, when uh, President Biden's Supreme Court proposal gets to Capitol Hill, uh, in my opinion, it's as dead as Woodrow Wilson. I don't think the House will even bring it up. I, I don't know of anyone who's taking it that seriously. Number two, uh, I don't think President Biden's proposal is really President Biden's proposal. I think it's uh, Vice President Kamala Harris's proposal. When the president uh, announced it, she immediately endorsed it enthusiastically. I think she's asked him to take the lead so in case there's blowback, it doesn't get on her. Um, number three, uh, the, the Biden-Harris proposal is not about the Supreme Court, in my opinion. It's about abortion. Particularly, uh, Vice President Harris is very angry at the Supreme Court for saying abortion's not in the Constitution and sending the issue back to the people in the states. She supports a national rule which basically says abortion on demand. A woman can have an abortion at any point, even up until the moment before birth. Uh, the Vice President, I think most Americans see abortion as try, the issue of abortion is trying to balance the rights of a woman and an unborn child. I think the vice president sees it, sees, uh, or thinks that the unborn baby has no rights, none whatsoever. She's entitled to her opinion, but I don't think that's mainstream. Uh, 